Even with a majority Christian population, there are still laws in Europe that discriminate against them. That's the conclusion from several experts and ambassadors to the Holy See. And uh, now we see the in, ongoing and growing uh, phenomena of discrimination against Christians. We don't use the word, the term persecution. We call it discrimination if it's about legal restrictions affecting Christians. In its last report, the Observatory on Intolerance and Discrimination Against Christians tallied 41 discriminatory laws among 15 countries. It also counted 169 cases of intolerance against Christians in the wider European Union. The report cites as an example the lack of legal protections for pharmacists that refuse to sell contraceptives or also public employees that consciously object to registering same-sex weddings. 76% of Europeans consider themselves Christians. It means that we should try just to combat this phenomenon. Christians should not think that only the bishops have the role to defend moral and natural law in the public debate. Every Christian can, or nearly every Christian can contribute. To correct the issue, experts said there needs to be a change in attitude. Christians need to lose their fear of standing up for what they believe in, they added, using all lawful means at their disposal. But these experts also urged people to be more open to dialogue. According to them, Christian beliefs must not be imposed on others, but rather passed on and developed.